Oh boy, this is the fun part. <laughs> As you can see, we got our two can lights in. We also got the ceiling fan in. It's funny because the original light location was not centered. So now we have some patching to do up there. We got our blocking in, our little header. We have our electrical and our cable is in there going into the closet. So we're getting ready to hang this piece of drywall. Bear, let's measure to the bottom of this and write it down so we can remember. All right, so move it to the bottom. 37 and a quarter, basically. Okay, so we'll just call it 37 inches. Okay, so now we're going to, well, we're gonna hang that piece of drywall and install this bookcase, recess it into the wall. You ready? Ready. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna, this is really not the right kind of drill. I have a drywall gun that sets the screw just the right depth. You're not really supposed to break the paper, but it's kind of hard to do. On these drills, it's either on or off. You gotta be careful. <laughs> I see I broke the paper on that one. So it's not a big deal, it's just something you kind of have to do. It loses its holding power, some of the holding power when you break the paper. But you don't want it sticking out either. Because <laughs> it'll make a lump in the wall. I missed! Boy, did you mark them studs? <laughs> uh, Probably good enough, isn't it? Here's a little trick. Come in here, Barrett. All right. You know, when you, when you put a, uh, a screw in through drywall and you miss, there's nothing to I've got it in reverse, see? It's not coming out. Take your fingernail, put it behind the screw, put a little pressure on it, and pull it out. Nice. <laughs> now, where's the stud? That's odd. That's really odd. <laughs> you know what I did? I bet you anything I stuck that screw right between the header and the uh, stud. Isn't that funny? Because hmm. that's right in line with the stud. Let's go in here. See? In a knot. Always get me doing the girl. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cleaning up is something you just gotta do. What? Cleaning up is just something we gotta do, man. It's not girly. Well, that looks pretty good. Got our drywall hung, got our bookcase installed, got our little patches done. Now the trim will cover those gaps right there. I'll shim them out, but uh, that's kind of narrow to be putting little pieces of drywall. I'll get a, some little pieces of half-inch plywood or something to shim before we put our trim on. But uh, now we just have to get our uh, painter over here to mud and dry, uh, mud the drywall and paint, and we'll be ready for trim. Only took two hours. <laughs> take that long did it oh. all righty well I'm gonna call the painter mm -hmm.